I stopped studying and I don't think he would be proud of that, but I would have never come in Australia if he hadn't died. So that's kind of the good part, if I can say. For example, now that I moved to Australia, my mom is alone there and it's really hard to just leave her alone if anything happens with her. Because I was, I'm the only daughter, so she she doesn't have any company and sometimes I feel really bad because she's completely alone and if he was there with her she would have someone on to like someone to rely on someone to talk if he was to be alive now I would probably not be going out as much as I do now and he would be a bit more protective of me so like right now my mom, I have a lot of guy friends I go out a lot I don't wear the most appropriate clothing and like my dad would probably have a heart attack if he saw me like in a skirt he'd be like oh my god like your legs are showing please <laughs> cover it so that's one thing that's like different I would be a bit more like probably not as free as I am now with my boyfriend as well um, at the time that was really supportive um, he stayed with me even though he cheated but he stayed and I'm really grateful for that I guess I just needed a man mm. in my life that losing my dad was just losing my safety my safety and everything and yeah having a boyfriend was just really helpful last relationship because he was uh, 12 years older than me and sometimes he said to me oh I think sometimes I treat you like I was your dad and you were my daughter because he was so protective and he went to give me everything and just carrying on a way that a dad does. And I, I stayed with him for seven years, even though I don't think I liked him, loved him as a man that much, but maybe the fact that he was like, maybe, um, you know when you have a hole and you- Yeah, feel like it's something. Yeah, he was feeling this hole that I had. I smoke cigarettes as well and I've realized I don't want to do to my kids what my dad did to me even though he didn't really do it to me he did um, he knew that smoking was gonna kill him and he did it anyway and that's exactly what I'm doing as well but I'm just I've changed as well I think it made me stronger because I was yeah I was the little girl the, the little princess I just didn't care about anything and now I have to take care of myself. And yeah, it did make me stronger. I've learned to appreciate money and like all of my family. Like I've just learned to appreciate everything more. I'm not really like, I don't spend my money too much. I don't look at brands and be like, oh, I'm gonna buy a Louis Vuitton. My cousins have Louis Vuitton bags and they're always like, oh, and I'm just sitting down with my Colette backpack. Like, you can't judge me. <laughs> I'm happy, you know what I mean? Losing him so young made me, made me like value other things more, like value less material things and care more about people, and more about family and who you have and appreciate like small moments with your family and see what really cares in life. There are not things 